Uh, good afternoon, welcome to Bravo Music Store. I'm Nate Zeisler and with me is Chelsea Schumann and we're going to be showing you today some uh, examples of our newest product, uh, Bravo Bassoon Reads. So Chelsea's going to start by uh, playing an F major scale for you and what I'd like you to notice is her ability to stay loose in her embouchure and to attain a vibrant sound uh, throughout the entire scale that she performs. Great. And we know that one thing that is uh, very prevalent among middle and high school bassoon students is that they don't attain that vibrant sound that, that Chelsea just was playing. And what we're looking for in order to attain that uh, beautiful vibrant sound is partly their use of air. We talk about having a solid volume of air going through the instrument at all time with a loose embouchure uh, for every given note that they perform. So my motto is the, the fastest air possible with the loosest embouchure possible for every given note. And Chelsea's doing a great job with this. Chelsea would not be able to uh, achieve this sound if she didn't have a functioning reed. And to give you an example, Chelsea's going to play now uh, a, on a store-bought reed, not one of the uh, Bravo Music Store reeds. And she's going to do nothing different with her air or her embouchure. And I want you to just notice the difference in sound. <laughs> So the problem is that this reed is too long, and it's a f so it causes the instrument to play flat. And if Chelsea has, she may have the correct setup, which we know she does. Uh, the, so therefore, the variable is the reed that she's playing. Uh, Chelsea's going to now play this one more time, and she's going to adjust her embouchure and her air to make the s scale come out in tune. And what I want you to notice is uh, what what's happening with her chin what's happening with her lips, and what's happening to the overall sound that you hear while she's playing. In general, what we notice is a tightening of the embouchure. Sometimes you might see a student smiling or frowning when they play. You might see a bunching up of their chin. All of these things are things we want to avoid in bassoon playing. Uh, ultimately what will happen is when they get to that third register the the notes will be flat because they're playing on a flat reed and they have to pinch or bite with their embouchure to get the sound to come out that makes it a muffled sound a muted sound and not vibrant into the third register I'm gonna have Chelsea finish today by playing one more time on uh, a Bravo music store reed and uh, just to give you a sense of, of uh, the difference in sound With the right air, the right embouchure, and the right reed, you can attain a great sound uh, throughout the entire length of the instrument. And I hope this demonstrates uh, the effectiveness of the Bravo uh, Bassoon Reed uh, product. So thank you for your time and have a great afternoon.